Hello everyone, I am your teacher and welcome to another video lesson in reading and writing subject. Our objective for today is identifies claims explicitly or implicitly made in a written text. We will be focusing on the following claim facts, claim of value, and claim of policy. Explicit. Explicit is from the word explicitus, which means obvious and apparent, or directly stated. While well, implicit, from the word implicitus, which means not expressed clearly or only suggested, only suggested or indirectly stated. So what's the difference again? If we say explicit, the information is expressed directly. While well, implicit, the information is not expressed directly. What is a claim? A claim class is a statement that is not considered accepted by all. It may be unverified or controversial to a certain degree. It is usually related to one side of the issue. It is also called a position, and it is argumentative and specific. It is a single statement. The topic of an argument, it is not a question, it is a phrase against the status quo, and a secret argument or a thesis statement of the text, it is what the writers try to prove in the text by providing details, explanation, and other types of evidence. So what are the characteristics of a good claims? A claim should be argumentative and debatable. A claim should be specific and focused. A claim should be interesting and engaging. And it should be logical. There are three kinds of claim. First, claim fact. Second, claim value. And a third is claim of policy. Are you familiar with these? Maybe you are. Claim of fact. What is claim of fact? It is a statement of something that has existed, could be past, existing or present, or will exist in the future and are based in facts or data. It is argumentative thesis which makes a quantifiable assertion. In other words, it is an argument or claim about a measurable topic or fact. Debates whether it is true or false. There are types of factual claims. And always remember in class that it is usually objective and not subjective. Number one, factual or historical could be based on facts and history. Two, it is relational, meaning it's causal connection. Three, and it is productive. What are the proofs? First, sufficient and appropriate grounds. Then, reliable authority, recent data, accurate or typical data, clearly defined terms, which means no loaded language, and a clear distinction between fact and inference. Examples. Dito Cabal is the town's municipal mayor. Hinda was derived from a large tree named Indam. Number 8 multiplied to itself is equal to 64. Hinda is politically subdivided into 20 barangays. Himakila is popular for its mountain trekking. So those are facts. Then we have claim of value. It is based on preference such as likes, dislikes, good or bad. Just a while ago, we discussed about facts, claim of facts. It is more on facts. Now, 
it is more on what you like and you dislike, which is claim of value. It is an argumentative thesis which makes a qualifiable assertion. In other words, it is an argument or claim about a moral, aesthetic, or philosophical topic or value. Claim of value involves judgment and evaluations. It judges whether something is good or bad, right or wrong, just or unjust, ethical or non-ethical, etc. We judge the worth of something. It attempts to prove that something are more or less desirable than others. Here are some requirements. Establishing standards of evaluation. Example, a warrant that defines what constitutes instances of a relevant value. Note the priority of the value in the instance. Establish the advantage or practical or moral of your standards. Use examples to clarify abstract values. Use credible authorities for support. Examples Hinan National High School is the best school in Hindan. What is your head there that that claim is value? Yes, because of the word best. Canigao Island is a better place to go for summer vacation than Apin Island. What's your hint there because of the word better? Then, cheating men are undesirable to women. The word there is undesirable. Mercy killing is immoral. The word immoral. And the last computer are valuable addition to modern society. The word is valuable. It discusses really about value of things value of something. Get it? Then we have claim of policy. It is a statement that indicates that an action must be taken in specific policies. It is an argumentative thesis which makes an assertion about a course or action the reader should take. In other words, it is an argument of claim about an actionable topic or policy from the word policy. a specific course of action. It asserts that specific policy should be instituted as solution to problems. Argues that certain conditions should exist almost always, should, or ought to, or must are included in this claim. So these are the words that would give you hint that this claim is policy. Here are some proof requirements. Making proposed action clear, need justification, plan must be workable, benefit or advantages, and consider opposition or counter arguments. Take note class. A claim of policy usually contains the following expression, should, must, or ought. Asserts that specific policy should be instituted as solution to the problem. Examples Congress should reduce the drinking age to 18. We should respect everyone in school. The use of cell phone not related to the class should be prohibited. The age at which people can get driver's license must be raised to 18. And testing while driving around Hindu should be an offense and punishable by chain. With the underlying words, these are your hints that this claim is claim of policy with the use of should and must be. Look at here some examples. That claim. The zone is in the state of COVID-19 outbreak. For value of claim, Hindang National High School is a better school than other school. For, for policy claim, grade 12 students should comply first the requirements before having an immersion. So, for claim fact, it's just stated about an existing of COVID-19 outbreak. For claim value, it states the value of a certain school. And for policy of claim, the policy, the school should have a policy that all students must or all grade 12 students 
must comply first the requirements before you're going to have their emotion. Fact, claim, casualty. The death penalty does not deter crime. Value claim. Capital punishment is unjust. Policy claim. The death penalty should be abolished. I want you to identify the kind of claim each sentence belongs. Honesty is the best policy. What is that? Yes, claim of value. To attract more students, St. Michael College of Indian Leyte Incorporated must review its course offering. What is that? Correct, claim of policy because of the presence of the word must. Number three, Himokilan Island is one of the islands of Cuatro Islas. What do you think is the answer? Correct, claim of fact because it is fact. That Himukilan Island is one of the island of Cuatro Islas. How about number four? Hindang BFP should get ready always, especially this coming New Year's Day. What is that? Claim of policy because of the presence of should. They should. How about number five? Obesity can cause heart disease and diabetes. What is that? Claim of fact. Very good. Here is your performance test. I want you to write your answers in the comment section below. What is claim? How important is claim to your daily life as a student? So, thank you for watching and happy learning with us. God bless us all and good luck. Yeah.